a 32 years old male receiving blood transfusion after being involved in road traffic accident. A few minutes after the transfusion, he complains of loin pain. His observation shows temperature 39 degrees Celsius, heart rate 130 beats per minute, blood pressure 95 over 40 millimeter mercury. So, what is the best test to confirm this diagnosis? That means when blood transfusion done, actually the patient develops the hypersensitivity reaction or ABO incompatibility reaction. So, uh, by which we can diagnose here the options options are you ultrasonography of the abdomen direct comb test blood culture blood film and sequel cell test so first of all let's see the complication of the blood transfusion here the some immune mediated causes such as the pyrexia auto allo immunization thrombocytopenia transfusion associated lung injury graft versus host disease urticaria acute or delayed hemolysis, ABU incompatibility, and non immune causes such as hypocalcemia, CCF or congestive cardiac failure, infections, and hyperkalemia. But in this condition, there is most probably the ABO incompatibility because the ADO, ABO incompatibility it affects first. Now, here we can see the direct cum test and indirect cum test. In direct cum test, what happens actually? the red blood cell present in our body the red blood cell is collected and the solution is given then if there is reaction that means the direct cum test is test reaction is positive on the other hand here we can see in case of indirect cum test there is two times reagent given on times there is given antibody in the serum and then it binds with the rbc the, and second time given another substances and this substance is now bind with the previously sensitized substances and this is the indirect cum test and here we can see the indirect cum test also again first of all the rbc the rbc binds with the antibodies and it again gives to the recipient and then what say then the agglutination occur so by which test it is the direct cum test because we collect the blood and direct uh, we give the antibody and we can see the reaction